हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम मधुरा वेलकम टू मधुराज रेसिपी डॉट कॉम टूडे आई एम मेकिंग वेजिटेबल उपमा अ वेरी सिंपल एंड इजी टू मेक सो टू बिगिन विथ वी आर गोइंग टू ड्राई रोस्ट अवर सूजी और सेमोल इन अ फर्स्ट सो इन अ पैन आई एम एडिंग हाफ टी स्पून ऑफ घी घी एड्स वेरी नाइस फ्लेवर एंड टेक्सचर इन दिस उपमा इन दैट गोज इन हाफ कप ऑफ सूजी मिक्स दैट इन and i'm going to dry roast it on medium heat for like about 4 to 5 minutes we don't need to fry this or roast this for a longer time otherwise the taste of this suji changes and it gets slight bitter taste so to avoid that just dry roast on medium heat for just about 4 to 5 minutes while dry roasting suji or semolina it is always a good idea to use stainless steel pan or iron skillet or kadai Uh, as this uh, suji has little bit of coarse texture and if you roast that using non stick pan uh, it might damage the coating of non stick so to avoid that i always preferably use a stainless steel or iron pan now over here i have dry roasted this on a medium heat for about 4 to 5 minutes now let's just keep this aside we don't want suji to change its color Now next in a kadai i have preheated 1 tablespoon of oil and first i'm adding drop peanuts and we are going to fry them up now if you are watching this videos for the first time and if you like them do hit the subscribe icon you can see that in right below this video and once you hit the subscribe icon you can also hit the bell icon so that you will get informed about my all latest videos so over here peanuts have changed its color and it has got light brown color now i'm going to remove them into a dish we are going to save this for garnishing now once the peanuts are re removed let's go ahead and add in tempering so first goes in half teaspoon of mustard seeds let them crackle then half teaspoon of cumin seeds or jeera rai and jeera hing asafoetida quarter teaspoon curry leaves green chili and then half cup finely chopped onion and 2 teaspoon of green beans mix that in and cook this for 3 to 4 minutes and it looks nice and soft now next add in 2 tablespoon of green pepper yellow pepper red pepper now instead of using bell peppers you can also use some carrots green peas any vegetable of your choice like broccoli mix that in and cook for Three to four more minutes, and here everything gets cooked for four to five minutes now. Now, at this point of time, add in this dry roasted suji. Mix that in. And for half cup of suji, I'm adding three quarter cup of hot water. mix that in I'll add in salt at this time mix that in now you always need to use hot water while making upma because a uh, suji is hot and if you add cold water in hot suji it will get that sticky texture and the upma will not turn nice and fluffy so to avoid that always use hot water now let's close this up and let this cook on low to medium heat for 5 minutes and upma is cooked on low to medium heat for 5 minutes now wow it looks so good and it smells so good its flavor is just awesome it has turned nice and steaming hot and you can see that it has turned nice and fluffy it is not dry at the same time it is not 
sticky either and this is the perfect consistency we are looking for nice and fluffy upma now if you want to make this little bit soft just add some more water and finally lots of finely chopped coriander leaves superb and also you can add this fried peanuts while serving upma looks fabulous i hope you liked my today's video for more such quick and easy recipes please visit my website that is www.madhuradrecipe.com also don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you for watching see you soon bye bye